All the way back in 2008, there was a little game launch called Moshi Monsters, which quickly grew in popularity and died off as quickly as it gained. It was a lot like Club Penguin, if you guys remember that. Now, of course, at the time of making this video, it's 2019, so this game is almost 11 years old. And, well, my hopes aren't exactly high, but I wonder if anyone's still playing this thing in 2019. Alright, so it looks like we caught the website in the middle of the Moshi Monsters as seen on TV egg hunt, so, um, that's nice, I guess. And the fact that the website's not secure is a good sign. Oh my lord. This is honestly kind of cute. I do remember having an account for this, so I'm going to see if I can actually guess my username and password here for almost 10 years ago. Oh my god, I think I actually got in. And I need Flash Player to play Moshi Monsters. I already have Flash Player. What? Okay, that took a second, but here it goes. Um, so it looks like this is entirely website-based, and, um, what is this? It's trying to eat my mouse! Um, I, I guess this is my monster from ten years ago? Um, oh gosh, why is this lagging so much? Um, I apparently have 21 visits, and three-star rating in my house, I guess, so don't know who was visiting my house. And I have a little seahorse thing. I remember this game having things called Moshlings, I believe, which I think were pets. Anyhow, my monster here. It will bite to eat would be good. Well, we're not feeding you, little guy. Sorry, you can starve. My monster is a woe gone. He's not healthy and he's not happy. And he has a popularity rating of T. Don't know if that's good, but... Poodle! Poodle! Th that's literally a poodle! What is this game? That's just a poodle! I don't see how this is trying to pass this out as some type of monster. This is... This is literally just a poodle. And like this, you can't tell me this isn't just a seahorse. Okay, looks like we have a bunch of options here. Um, we have a notepad. Wonder if I have anything up in here. Well, I believe I was 10 years old when I posted this, so that seems about right. And I apparently actually logged in in 2015. I don't remember doing that. Now, what's this thing? Is this a gift box of some sort? Um, loading from the Super Mushies. What is this? The Super Mushies need me. I think we'll check that out in a second. Okay, how about we check out the garden here? Let's see. Um, okay, so I vaguely remember this. I remember you having to plant seeds and I guess sort of like an old loot box system, but it did as an tin. You planted seeds and a mostling came and like you had to find rare mushrooms and stuff like that. And looks like you get better seeds if you're a member, so that's kind of expected and looks like you get better seeds if you're a member so i'm not surprised hall of puzzles okay they're actually like games on here wow um bubble trouble okay let's play bubble trouble and see how this works okay again that took like 10 seconds to load these are like flash games why are they taking so long to load which color is not touching any green dots um, red? Which color is not touching any black dots? Um, none of them? I guess they want green, right? Not touching any green dots, yellow. Not touching any yellow dots, um, that would be green. Okay, is this just what? <laughs> How is this a puzzle? I mean, I know this is supposed to be made for like 10 year olds, but really? How about Lying Dance? I apparently had 12 medals in this one, so looks like my 10 year old self got the best at this. How many lines are there? Um, one, two, three, four, five. There are five lines in here. Oh, uh, is this all this is? Are these just like reading puzzles? Oh my gosh, you could pet the poodle. 10 out of 10, best game ever made. And looks like I've stumbled across the world map. Um, 
let's see where we can go. Right, let's see, Main Street. Maybe we'll go there. Okay, um, looks like there's some other monsters here. Oh my god, wait, wait a second, what? Are these actually other people? What the crap? Are actually other people playing this? And you can see their ages too, um... That's a bit weird. Why you can why can you see the other people's ages? Here's someone that's 16 playing this for some reason. I thought it might be weird for other people to see that I'm 20, but if there's someone here that's 16, I'm not too concerned. Why is there someone that's 16 playing this? Oh, and looks like I discovered the shop. Um, don't know if I have any money, but I'll take this. Please? No, too expensive. Okay, apparently I can't buy anything. But come on, how do, how do I feed my monster? He's dying. Guess my monster will just die of hunger. Capitalism. The Daily Growl. Is this like a newspaper office or something? No, I can't even enter it. So what's the point? And it looks like the website just crashed. So that's something. <laughs> Now, on second thought, it looks like that actually just opened up the newspaper or blog for some reason. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of Moshi monsters. Another great Moshi giveaway. I wonder... 19 comments. I wonder how quality some of these are going to be. Let's see here. Thank you. Thanks so much. Thanks for the seed. Thanks. This Moshi is so cool. wonder what happens if you click on someone's profile. Let's see here. Okay, generally it's been 30 seconds. Why does this website take so long to load? Okay, looks like they have a pretty <laughs> good room, I guess, and have a little blue furry thing here. Is that Bigfoot? Well, okay, um, well, looks like they have a far better room than I have. I'll, I'll give them a five-star rating, sure. And again, they're apparently 15 years old. Why are people over the age of 10 playing this? Then again, I guess I'm 20, so what am I supposed to be saying? Alright, back to the map. Let's see what fun things we have here. Oola Lane, Main Street. Is this just Club Penguin? Goosebump Manor, Home, Dress Up Room, Motion Garden, Party Place, Gift Island. Hmm. Moshi Movie TV Studio. Looks like we're going to Hollywood. We're going to be the next Leonardo DiCaprio. Oh, and gosh, there are a lot of people here. 50... What? There is no way. I fail to believe that there's someone 57 years old playing this game. And what am I saying? Apparently this person's 23. What the heck? So apparently I need a membership to even do anything here, so that's just great. Is there anything else I can play? Are there, are there like any games or something, please? Puzzle Palace, we checked out. Volcano. Um, looks like everything's completely locked. Uh, how about Goosebump Manor? I don't know if it's just me, but I don't like the way this monkey's looking at me. And also, this page has literally been loading for two minutes. Maybe I should just refresh or something. <laughs> Didn't even notice I apparently have four friends. I wonder who they are. Carson Cody Cycle. Um, says he's 49, but I believe... That has to be my old friend from school. I believe he's like 17 now, so... Don't think that age is right. And apparently have three friend requests as well. Perhaps 49 is just a default age. Looks like half of these areas are either bought by membership or you have to join that superhero thing to even click, so that's just great. Oh here, Moshi Fun Part. Maybe this is where the games are. Okay, why do half of these look like old Flash games that they probably don't even own? And Kung Fu Hula Challenge? I do love me some Jack Black and Tenacious D, so I may just have to check that out. How about Moshling Fling? Because it looks like the only thing they may actually own the rights to. Let's see here. Flumpy the Fluff and Moshling Fling. Um, why is there a story here? Come on. Wait, is this just Angry Birds? Seriously, is this just an Angry Birds ripoff? Um, sure, let's launch our Moshling. Yeah, this looks- Oh, this isn't- <laughs> Oh my god, no, this isn't a ripoff of Angry Birds. You know what this is? 
This is a ripoff of freaking. This is a ripoff of that freaking pet pet march game from Neopets. How about Run Shelby Run? Is this going to be a ripoff of something else too? Okay, again, looks like there's a thing here. Level one. Um. Okay, perhaps I should have read the instructions. How do you play this exactly? Um. Spacebar. Okay, looks like you just jump. Um. Okay, looks like this may be an original game, but it's certainly not breaking any barriers here. Um. Yeah, this looks like it could be great fun, but I'm going to have to exit out of this before I get a brain aneurysm. How about Pet Grooming Studio? Um. Well, that's a, certainly a cute little doggy there. Select your pet. I'll go with the Yorkshire Terrier here. Okay, there's no way that they made this one. This has to be some free Flash game that they had the rights to, right? Okay, use the sponge to wash the pet. Okay, again, my attention span is not long enough for this. Okay, let's get to the good ones I know you guys want to see. Neon Cat Fly in the Kung Fu Panda game. Sponsored by Moshi Monsters, so looks like they don't even own the rights to this one. It's just sponsored oh, Lord. Okay, I wonder if this is going to get me copyright struck. So I'm going to turn down the volume here Okay, um Okay, this is great gameplay. This is just a Okay, great gameplay here, um I could probably get a score of like 30,000 in this, but I'm again going to exit out before I get some type of disease. Okay, the moment you've all been waiting for, Kung Fu Hula Challenge. Alright, let's see what this is here. Not reading the instructions. Wait, this actually has voice acting? Oh, it's actually Jack Black too, wow. Or at least sounds like him. I it just failed, but it's great. Um. So is this just like a really, really like bad rhythm game for little kids? <laughs> I wonder how much they had to pay Jack Black to actually voice at this. Let me see what happens if you get the battle out. Ran out of steam. Yes, I did. Oh no, we, ha we get to see Sad Poe. That breaks my heart. Wow, this is really old. Kung Fu Panda 2, 2011. Wonder how they still have the rights to even run this thing. Let's see here. Well, there are a lot of games. Wow. Donut Ninja? I vaguely remember that, and I am certain they don't own the rights to that. Okay, how many uh, how many pages are there? So there are five pages of games for some reason, so... I mean, at least Neopets has, like, original games. They probably have about a hundred Flash games, and they're all original. Like, this has to steal most of their games from other people, so... Not getting many points for me in that respect. Okay, I think I've had most of this as I can take, but there's three things I'm noticing at the top up here. Forum, membership, and store. Oh my god, my ears! Okay, good thing we got that sorted out here. Let's see, um, membership cards, uh, continue. I wonder how much a membership is for this thing. Let's see. Six dollars per month, okay. Well, let's see how much a six month membership is. Um, oh, you have to buy this with cards, so I guess six months isn't something I really can complain about because six dollars per, well, that is a lot of stores, wow. I wonder if any of these places actually still sell these things because again, wonder them when the last time this thing was updated was. How about the forum? I'm sort of curious about that. I wonder if it's still updated. So there's only one forum board, which is Monster City News, so that's always great. Um, let's see here. Who likes Moshi Monsters? Wow, this is really inactive. 2015, really? So it looks like this forum hasn't been touched in 2015. That's sort of interesting. And last thing here is the store. I wonder if... Wow, okay. Adopt your own pet mushling, sure. So there's a mobile game. Okay, that's something that all websites have to do. Again, even Neopets did that. Trading cards. Um, apparently they're trading cards. I wonder if they still sell these things. 
toys as well? Okay, apparently there are toys for this. Free in-game gifts. How many figures come with each pack? Wow. Oh, it looks like there's actually a cart option, so I imagine you can actually buy this stuff from the website. Okay, to be honest, these are sort of cute, so I'll give them pluses for that. And I don't think I can really complain about that, considering I have a big display of Neopets playsets and toys on my shelf, so... And of course, like, 50 plushies lying around, so I don't think I can really complain about websites doing that. But I think that's about all of this website I can take for today, and probably all time.